Okay, this is the phone. I'm coming to replace the charging system. Okay, this one is a glass. You have to very be careful when you open it. If you have the heater at home, you just have to put water inside the pot and put on the gas. When the water is boiled, just put the pan on top. When the pan becomes very hot, you put the phone. At least this one can become hot a bit so the glue becomes weak for you because this is glass. You don't need to force to open it so you don't break the glass, okay? So after you heat it a bit, okay, you just use the pencil to open it like this a bit. Be careful. Just put it down inside the small so you don't crack it. Okay, then you find something like a rubber like this, something very a bit soft, so I don't crack the glass. Just put it there like this. Okay, you remove the metal. If you try to open it right on. Okay. Open the glue right on. Okay. When you hit it, make it more easy for you to open. After you hit it properly, become warm. Okay. Open it right on like this, slowly. Okay. Try to remove it slowly like this. The glue is too hard okay don't worry about this you put it back this is the camera cover okay now you need to take out all the screws so many screw back of this phone make sure you take out all the screw you have to take out all the screw okay because you need to disconnect the battery first before you can replace the charging system you need to open the motherboard as the motherboard a bit up and pass the uh, connector inside there also okay so you take out this uh, connector remove it Take out all the screw back of the phone. So many screws. You have to remove all the screw because you need to take out the motherboard also. So you can fix the connector very nice down there. Okay. So you have to remove all the screw. After I take out all the screw, okay, you remove the sensor charger. Place it up like this. So I come out with this cover. Remove it together. Okay. You disconnect the battery from here. Okay. Remove this one also. Remove the ringer down also. Okay. Now you disconnect the LCD cable from this side. Okay. Now you need to remove this uh, cable, network cable. Be careful you don't spoil anything here. Just remove it slowly so you don't spoil anything from the board. Okay. Remove this one also. Do it slowly. Just make sure you sit up like this. Okay. Now you need to remove this cable all. Okay. Then you remove this screw from the charging system also here. Remove all the screws. Put them on one side. Remove this one also. Make sure you remove all the screws. Okay. When you remove this screw for this jack, you remove the jack also. The, the headphone jack pin. Just ace it up like this. Yeah, just ace it up like this. You can use the pencils if you like. You don't have nails. Just ace it up like this. Okay. You take it out. Put it one side. Okay. Continue to remove the screw from the charging system because the charging system has four screws. You have to take out all the screws. Okay. You remove the screw. There's another screw here also in the corner here. Make sure you watch properly. Okay. Take out the screw also. Okay. Now you need to disconnect the camera cable from here because you need to remove the motherboard so you can fix the charging system from down on the side. Okay. Remove this other connector here also. Okay. And now you have to take out the same tray. Remove the same tray, put it one side. Okay. Then you try to remove the charging system. Okay. Just is the, the board up like this a bit. Remove this cable all. Just remove everything. Okay. Is the board up like this a bit. Okay. You remove the charging system up like this. Very nice with the motherboard. Okay. You move it to the motherboard all. Everything. Okay. Don't forget to disconnect the camera, front camera, okay. Okay. After you remove it, they disconnect the charging system from this side, from the board. Just ace it up like this. You see, you just ace it up, you remove it. Okay. Then you connect this one also. Make sure you connect it very the right position, very nice. Like this, before you press it in like this, very nice. Okay. Now you need to remove this network cable here. You see them? Just remove the exactly how it's supposed to be. Slow down. Don't spoil it. You can use the pen set. You take it out. Okay. You, when you remove this first one, you fix it back where you, you fix it first, so you don't mix the cable up because there are two different cables. Make sure you get the right position like this before you press it in. And this network is supposed to fix very nice, so that the phone no lost network. Okay. Fix it very nice like this. Okay. Then you remove this other one also here. Okay. Put this charge system different side. Okay. Then you fix this one also here. Very nice. Okay. Like this. 
okay this green one supposed to be down the blue one and the white one supposed to be up okay after you fix the motherboard uh, they charge them very nice here okay now you fix the back the motherboard okay you make sure you slide the motherboard very nice like this and make sure the connector all is up okay before you can remove the front camera so it will be more easier for you if you want to like but just leave it there like this okay put it like this and just ease the connector up slide it a bit slide the motherboard inside there okay slide the motherboard inside there okay and make sure the charging the battery cable is up this one okay it's supposed to be up like this okay so the motherboard will rest inside very nice when you put the motherboard inside don't force to put it inside just do it slowly slowly the motherboard will rest properly by itself okay very nice like this okay then you connect this other connector up here don't connect the battery connector yet battery connector is the last one you're supposed to connect okay then you connect the camera very nice okay make sure this one rests properly connect the LCD cable very nice like this okay now you need to put the charging system inside you just slide the the mouth inside bend it a bit like this slide it inside like this so you can go inside and rest properly like this okay and put this also like this okay you replace first the screw you take out from the charging system replace these two screw okay replace this other one also here okay Place this one here also. Just make sure where you place this, we place it the right place, okay? Because some screws too supposed to come from the back and pass through the charging system. So make sure you place this screw the exact place where you take it out from, okay? So this one too, you have to bend it a bit so it can rest properly, okay? This one's supposed to rest properly from here. Bend it a bit inside, slide it inside the hole, okay, like this. Then you put back the screw. Put back the one screw from there okay now you put back the headphone jack you slide it inside okay just slide it inside like this very nice you can connect the connector here there's a connector you fix it properly okay then put back this one screw here okay now you need to ace this board up a bit be careful that this the, uh, the connector don't come out okay just ace it up a bit like this so you can pass this cable down there yeah because the cable needs to go down there like this okay just hold it with your one finger like this okay you pass the blue one the blue one first because okay. this cable is supposed to be down and pass it here down there like this under this this mother body corner there okay then you pass this one also all the two are supposed to be down there, like this, okay? Make sure you go inside very well like this, okay? Now you fix this one connector first here. Fix it very nice so that the phone will not lose network, so your network will become very strong. Okay, okay. When you hear the sound like this, already fixed perfect. Okay. This one is supposed to be in properly fixed inside there. Okay, make sure you go inside properly inside this hole down. There's a hole there. Just make sure you go inside properly because so the ringer will rest properly from this side. Okay, then you fix this other one also. Very nice. Make sure you get the right position before you press it in. They don't spoil the connector. If you spoil the connector, the network will become very, very weak. Okay, fix it very nice. Already fixed. Make sure you rest properly. Okay. Now you fix back the ringer. Fix back the ringer. Very, very nice. Replace back the screw from the ringer here yeah, first. Replace the screw for the ringer first to so rest properly. Okay. After you finish fix all these ones, okay, you fix this one here, fix it exactly how you take it, 
Et qui te reste pour parler de la glisse. Et il si on score sur tout ce qu'il y a. Il faut replace one. Après, il fixe tout. Il replace all the screw. Ok. Il faut connecter les batteries. Very nice. Ok. Then you fix back this cover, slide the cover in like this from the top. Okay, then you press this side hard so that this side will close properly. Okay, replace all the screws you take out, so many screws. You should replace all the screws. Okay. After you replace all the screw, okay, before you apply the glue right on the phone, make sure if there's no too much, if there's too much glue on top of the cover, just make sure you clean clean it more so the cover can rest properly. Okay, now before you put the glue, make sure you put this cover first. Put the uh, make sure you put the fingerprint first. Very nice. Okay, now you put the cover on top. Okay, just close it like this, very nice. Okay. Now you put the glue right on, don't put on top of the screw, just make sure you put it right on like this, very nice. Okay, put that at the edge also, very very nice, right on, very very nice, so the cover can rest properly. Okay, after I put the glue very very nice, okay, now you put the cover, put it very straight, don't bend it. Make sure it's very straight, don't burn it. Okay, you put this rubber at least for 30 minutes so the glue will come dry. If you have a rubber like this, you can use the slow tape at least for 30 minutes so the glue will come dry. Put at the top here also. Don't forget to put back the seam tray. Okay, now you put the phone on charge and test the charging system. Okay. Can you charge the charger? As you can see the charging logo. This will show you that the charging system is working perfectly. Everything is okay. See the battery is going up. That means it's okay. Hello guys. If you like my video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. 